So we're uh, gonna do a little trip down to Christina Sundahl's place, a little private track just northeast of Toronto. She is going to be the only one that I know that will fit into uh, into this old gear, this old Fox gear from back in the 80s. And uh, kind of as a little tribute almost to old Jeff McConkey. She's a very good friend of Jeff's. Jeff, as we all know, was the gear guy. So uh, she loves wearing the retro gear. So we're going to uh, make her dream come true today. So we'll uh, check in when we get to her track. Headed to a secret location. And it looks like it might just be motocross heaven around here. Someone opened a training facility oh, around yes. here. Wow. Motorport. Okay. Motorport. Not bad at all. This must be the place. Is that it over there? They're all in there. There's a bunch of people in there. That's my mom talking. Else. Let me, uh... <laughs> wow. I think that I have never experienced anything quite so amazing before. They were ugly when that they were. Is beautiful. They were ugly when they were new. <laughs> this is not ugly. Look at that. Wow, that's <laughs> gorgeous. Amazing. And I think that we were probably pretty close to the same size when you wore this. I was the size of a high school girl, yes. <laughs> I'm in my prime, 16. All right. That's awesome. She's going to rip that around. Absolutely. I can't wait. What's going on the tailgate here, Christina? You want to, uh, sorry, what? Say uh, what? Well, I like to entertain my, um, my guests. And so we've got some, um, we have some Caesar uh, mix and uh, fixins over here. And, uh, you know, because I think it's a beautiful day and people just want to have a nice Canadian Caesar on a long weekend. So, you know, after riding, though, always after riding. <laughs> oh, this gear. So far, that's our big debate. Is it planes, trains, and automobiles or trains, planes? Uh, it's... What is it, Christina? I don't know now. I was so confident before. All right. At least he was smart enough. I can't believe you're videotaping this right now. Well, this is the most embarrassing part. I got to get it. <laughs> Oh, My hip pad is turned. Thank you. Right out of Otherwise, I mean, I feel fast. I feel really fast in these. So what you're saying is if you're looking for a pair of pants to last you several different uh, centuries. Yeah, Fox. Fox what? is the way forward. That's the way to go. Absolutely. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, uh, just good. cornering. Cornering's tough. Hard to get the leg up. Hard to get the leg up <laughs> and move. I was, a small, move. I was a small teenage boy. <laughs> Fragile, in fact. There, I mean, I felt safe with the hip pads, though. Yeah. Janet, yeah. Felt really <laughs> safe <laughs> looks, with these. It looks good. So you know, yeah. This is a hoot. Thanks, uh, Billy. These were. Uh, this is super fun to check these out. I had no idea. How Can we still fun. find these in the catalog? <laughs> yeah. That's the question. I have no idea how much fun tight pants could be. <laughs> is everybody? I think everybody over here was talking about your tight pants. <laughs> I don't wear tight pants very often. <laughs> That was your cue to sing the song. I know. I, I just, uh, later. Later. Okay. Well, hey, thanks for trying them out. Uh, I think they're still in one piece, so maybe put something more, come, uh, more. Well, I just, I don't want to, 
break the. I feel like I peeled. Did you do that? Off. Did you do that? I think I did. I, I, I Those squeezed. were in perfect shape when I gave them to you. I'm a, I'm a <laughs> squeezer when I ride them. They look more faded too than they were when I gave them to you. <laughs> She's blowing the color right off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yeah. I don't know.